of you has earned this day. And I want to thank you for becoming the leaders that we need now more than we've ever needed before. Thank you for your dedication and your commitment to what I feel is the most noble profession of law enforcement. And I am pleased and frankly, I am very relieved that you are our future. Congratulations. This is something different. This, this puts you in that rarefied air that not a whole lot of people in law enforcement management know how to do. Command College is really, uh, in my mind, a state-of-the-art approach to preparing uh, leaders of the future in law enforcement. And I think Post has been ahead of the game in recognizing that, that leadership is really uh, a significant part of leadership is about preparing for the future. Post Law Enforcement Command College is a dynamic learning experience designed to prepare law enforcement for the challenges that will face our organizations tomorrow and beyond. Today's law enforcement leaders need to be prepared for the challenges of the future. Command College focuses on the most effective methods, skills, and strategies needed to successfully confront and effectively manage tomorrow's law enforcement issues. So you're taking kind of a, a very opinionated, a very skeptical group of people into a program and saying, well, we want you to open your mind up to the future. We want you to open your mind up to what may happen. It's about opening your eyes to scan for the future. What's coming? How could it affect me? And how do we best prepare for that? We're getting exposed to things outside of law enforcement that will down the line affect law enforcement or are affecting law enforcement now. Command College takes that seasoned officer that knows how to chase bad guys and dust for fingerprints and turns that seasoned officer into an executive who can look to the future. Any organization that's doing its job well will devote at least 5% of its time to thinking about where they're going instead of where they're at. And this helps set the groundwork for that. It develops a common language. It develops common sets of tools. Command College focuses on a number of topics, including the introduction of and teaching of leadership principles needed to influence the future direction of one's law enforcement organization. A leader takes people where they don't necessarily want to go. And that requires having a, a, a sense of vision. Uh, here's where I think we need to go, and, and my task as a leader is how do I persuade my community, my, my department, how do I persuade them to come with me? And that's, that's a lot of what the, our training goes through. How do you develop that vision, and then how do you help people take that journey with you? Command College also emphasizes the introduction of strategies to identify emerging issues and provide law enforcement leaders with the tools to create a proactive response. Anyone that comes in, one of their first tasks, which is a lot of times the most terrifying task, is to identify an emerging issue of relevance to the future of policing. Whatever it might be, we help them identify an issue and then refine its legitimacy as being worthy of study. Providing the skills and knowledge necessary to anticipate and prepare for the challenges of the future is also a cornerstone of Command College's approach. One of the things that we hope our participants come out with is, is, it, is that sensitivity to signals of change. And I may not have to deal with it right away. Uh, so it's almost like a triage. Here's the things I have to deal with now, here's the things that are on the horizon, and then here's the things I'm keeping one eye on. And Command College focuses on the most effective methods and benefits of sharing information and the use of colleagues and stakeholders in situation problem solving. I think the best thing is we've learned to work together as a team and we've made all sorts of contacts with other agencies around the state, uh, lots of connections. We always like to say Command College is not the, the traditional post-training course. It's a graduate level course where they really study and they really research. It's different uh, and because of that it's more valuable. The master stroke was rather than merely doing executive development that it was a course grounded in foresight and futures. Uh, the second master stroke was to not draw cops as trainers to help improve where the profession is at, but to bring in leading experts from other elements of the futures world to talk about the police, about new technologies and new social movements. Since 1984, 
Command College has prepared law enforcement leaders to anticipate the dynamic changes that are the hallmark of the Golden State. Participants in Command College are able to enhance their executive leadership abilities through the following course objectives. Futures orientation, strategic management, developing the ability to anticipate and influence positive change, and help advance professional dialogue concerning emerging issues. It's really kind of forced me to look at everything in a different frame and understanding that it is so important to pay attention to all of the different trends and things going out there because almost everything could have some effect on law enforcement. I'm starting to look at things that are going to affect us in 15 to 20 years from now and what I can do about it today. If I could help shape not only what's going to happen in my department, but for California law enforcement, maybe even national law enforcement, that's the opportunity I have. The quality of the, the people that I'm taking the class with is something that uh, I've never been around before. Requirements for participation in Post Command College are as follows. A law enforcement leader must be currently employed on a management position or higher at a participating agency in the Post program. An individual must have at least two years experience in a leadership position, and a potential participant must have involvement in community and professional activities. It's been a transforming experience for me, and I can only see it helping my department and the law enforcement field in general uh, as a whole. This is an experience that every lieutenant, captain, even chief of police should have. Yes, it's work. Yes, it's reading, but it's good work. It's insightful work. It will make you grow as a person and a person in the profession. And I have the opportunity today, because of the tools I'm going to get from Command College, to put me in a position to help lead my agency uh, to better deal with our community in the future. You know, because if you don't, then you're behind the curb. Command College is an investment in those who will lead law enforcement's work into the next generation. And the work of Command College is a benchmark against which the highest aspirations of law enforcement leadership are measured. Graduates of Command College will uphold this tradition of excellence in the way they lead, influence, and respond to the challenges ahead. We know we are gonna do things differently. We know that we have a special responsibility that Command College has given us. And that special responsibility is to guide our agencies into the future and to help those behind us guide the agency into the future. You know, it's a kind of like that old Apple analogy, think differently, that's exactly what Command College is. You want to change not the face just of your organization, but the face of law enforcement, not just in California, but nationally, this is, this is definitely the program for you.